what's up everybody welcome back to the channel we're gonna do another review today and um i was going to walmart and i picked up a few things and um, i had mentioned this in another video um in my last video i believe that i had posted was the pig video on how to use that top brand and so uh, i wanted to start to go through this bag of goodies that i got from walmart um, looking at the different balloon items they had there and so uh the first thing out of that bag uh, that I, you know, wanted to review was, and I think this is really cool, some punch balloons. Yeah, check them out. Now, this is by a company called um, Way to Celebrate. Uh, you'll find they have um, different products in Walmart, and uh, they got a little bit of writing on the package. Um, the first thing I uh, noticed on the bottom here is they got the warning. Um, let's see exactly. It says, children under eight years old. Uh, can choke or suffocate on uninflated or broken balloons. Adult supervision required. Keep uninflated balloons from children. Discard broken balloons at once. You hear that? So these guys, I mean, I know for some of you guys that are balloon artists, uh, you know, we, we usually follow the, you know, under three rule. Um, but these guys, for the punch balloons, I mean, they're not messing around. They're not taking any chances. Children under eight years old. I mean, think about it. What would happen to our business of children under eight years old you know requires supervision to have um a balloon and and this one of all i mean this is a big balloon uh, versus a a you know our 260 balloon that we normally use anyway um so so on the back side here it says uh give you some instructions in case you're wondering how to use this, this is kind of cool so um let's see we have our inflate punch balloon to 16 inch diameter um hold a band in close close flat fist and start punching bam 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 closed fat is this like oh is this is this what we're doing no uh closed flat fist like this i don't know i'm gonna yeah i know i remember when i played with these i mean i think naturally you go like this and the rubber band's here and you go like this right and they just hits against your hand like that oops i don't mean to just got a little excited there all right and then it says avoid contact with any object that could puncture the balloon during use okay so if you have a bunch of relatives that smoke um, don't go up to them and be like, punch balloon, because they can be like, I don't think so, and hit it with the, c the cigar or whatever they got, okay? And at the bottom here, it says, made of natural latex rubber. Natural latex rubber, okay? Not natural plastic, but natural latex rubber from a rubber tree. Is the tree actually rubber? No, it's not. The sap is what I'm talking about, okay? So let's go ahead and tear into this baby, and let's take a look and see what's up, okay? All right, well, what are we going for? The civilized way, or are we going for the, uh, yeah, that's right. Arr, the Neanderthal way. Thank you very much. Okay, and I will just put that away like I always do. All right, here we go. Let's see. Comment down below. Should I go for red, green, blue, or yellow? Which is it going to be? Which is it going to be? Comment down below, and we will see which one it's going to be. Let's see. Aha. Uh -huh. Mm-hmm. Ah, well, oh, which one do you think I'm going to choose? I should ask that instead. <laughs> go figure. All right, let's go for... Do, 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 do. Oh, if this was my daughter, she would go for the red. But it's me, so I get to go for the blue. Ooh. Okay. All right, so let's go ahead and get these inflated, and let's see what's up. Oh, interesting to point out. They already put the rubber band on there for you, which is kind of cool. I like that. Very nice. One less thing to do. And you notice it on the end here, it is uh, looped. You see that? Because uh, you could definitely buy yourself a large, you know, round balloon and then just tie the rubber band on the end here. Uh, but notice they did that. They, they left a big old nozzle right there. So it's definitely easier to blow into. And you see that this is like, uh, it's uh, folded up, you know? Um, if you ever run into like 11 inch uh, or even I think there's a 16 inch balloon also, usually it's not folded up like this. So it's kind of interesting to see it uh, uh, done that way. It must be their process uh, when they make this. But again, a loop, I'm sure uh, from my creative types, uh, balloon artist, you're probably looking at this thing like, dude, what can I do with that? You can definitely do something with this, can't you? Get rid of the rubber band and maybe put something in the loop there. Almost like a, uh, if you look at it, almost like a, D, uh, a donut or a geo, um, except now this whole portion here has been blown out and then you got this little loop on the end here. So maybe at the end, um, I'll do something with it, but let's go ahead and um, get this baby inflated. A balloon octopus, about to have a headache. And you know what? And I found a better way to do this. What a knucklehead I am. Look at that. I just put it over my two fingers there. Aha! I think he's had enough. I think his uh, brain is uh, scrambled up a little bit. There he is right there. Like, your boy's a little dizzy. See ya. Boom. Whew. 
All right, talk about a party. <laughs> I took just a, a blew into it just about uh, five, five, about five times, and we got to this right here is uh, where we're at, and um, you know, things still under underinflated, so it's still pretty soft, and I think I'm gonna leave it at that. Actually, let me let me do it uh, one more time. Okay, there we go. All right, yeah, I'll give it a little squish. Feels nice and soft. Let's go ahead and tie this baby off. All right, and let's see. Okay, they said flat fist. Uh, let's see. I used to do what? What did I used to do? When I, I used to, I think I used to keep it on my thumb, and just my hand would be open. That's how I used to do it, like this. But they said a flat closed fist, but I, I wasn't sure exactly what they mean. I think flat. Um, I think flat, but then closed, and then punch. <laughs> so what I tell you, don't leave, don't leave it up to me to explain the instructions exactly. So I always used to just keep it on my thumb there, clipped. And I'll leave my hand open, right? So a nice flat palm click on my thumb. And then I'll just punch it like that. And that seemed to work good. It's like hitting the bottom right here. Uh, and so so I, I think it, it feels pretty good, like the quality. Now, um, let's talk about something, though. Um, I, I think this is an interesting thing, that uh, these were $2. But in the bag, if you counted them, um, it was four of them. So that means they are $0.50 cents a piece. So that's something to consider, um, you know, are you, are you going to get these? Well, you know what? Um, one of the pros in this would be that uh, you could get it, you know, um, in, in a pinch. If you don't have time, you could swing by and you could grab some, right? Um, I was thinking also, I didn't go to the Dollar Tree to see what they had yet, but maybe that'll be another mission. But um, one of the first things I did before I was going to do this video, some of the research I did, and I put a link in the description below, is there are some punch balloons on Amazon that I found and you could get um, 80 of them and they're they're more or less like this size so you know that's that's something to, to consider actually uh, <clears throat> that actually the link below is um, I, I did like an affiliate program or or excuse me some affiliate marketing and so if you go through the link that I put in the description um, it will support this channel actually if you end up buying those so that one was 80 pieces 1399 is what I saw it for and if you do the math on that, uh, like I said, these are four for two dollars. That's about fifty cents. But if you look at those, um, eighty of them for around thirteen ninety nine. That's about um, eighteen cents a piece. So um, consider that. And why why punch balloons? Um, you know, is is an option, something to have in your kit. Um, Michael Bay talked about this uh, in one of his live videos, and he was saying, and this is a good point, this could be one of those line ender items um, that you can hand out. You know, you get your big kids, they'll try to definitely inflate this themselves, uh, but for the smaller kids, you can definitely inflate it for them and, and get it going, and they're going to start playing with it. Before you know it, everybody's punching each other <laughs> with these balloons um, and, and having themselves a good time. So yeah, consider that. Um, yeah, doggone it. This, this color this, this color is really nice, actually. I really like it. And again, I like that they tied it on the bottom here so um so here's another review for you right here hope you uh, enjoy that and hopefully you find that informative like i said um i'm gonna keep uh, doing more videos like this about some more like i said i got a uh, a walmart bag full of some goodies that i found on on the aisle oh, i was wondering like what is itching me it's the piece of plastic from earlier it, it finally uh, got down there and uh, turned sideways or whatever so um thank you very much for hanging out uh far as this goes but let me also talk about one thing before i leave here and that is um for people who were looking for my videos that were about twisting um i i, I mentioned in the other video and i'll do so here just so you know in case this is your first experience with me um uh, I have, have moved my videos, uh, balloon twisting videos, over to patreon.com slash jlomagic. That's where you can find them. Um, I have a $5 sign up. Also, have a $10 uh, option if you want to get some clip art as well. Um, I'm, I'm adding videos on there. I'm trying to do do some more consistently. I just got back from the Florida Super Jam not too long ago. And so um, some of those uh, videos that I taught in the class, they're going to make their way over also to the Patreon. So if you're looking for them, you're wondering what happened to all the different videos, you'll see that I still have some on my uh, on my page, but those are um, balloons that use uh, printed balloons that I sell or that we have through available through uh, uh, LaRoxMagic.com. So um, that that's what that is all about. That's why you're going to still see videos here um, on my channel. But it's primarily, if you notice, they're all uh, printed balloons, is what those are. Okay, so I just wanted to make sure that you're well informed about you know what's going on with my channel, how you can still gain access to those videos. Uh, they're definitely there, and so. Um, but like I said, let me let me go back to the balloons here. Um, uh, like I said, in the link description below, if you're looking to get some punch balloons, which are kind of cool uh, to have, um, I'm gonna also do a review on those. But just follow the link in the description, and you'll be able to get yourself some punch balloons about 80 
for about $13.99 and hopefully that'll be something cool you can use. All right. Well, uh, I think our time has come to an end. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Uh, remember in the comments down below, let me know something that you're curious about seeing um, that you would like to be, uh, or that you would like to see reviewed, excuse me, um, if it's a balloon related product, okay? So anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoy your, the rest of your day and be look out for more, uh, be on the lookout for more videos and uh, happy twist and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.